Hello, welcome back. And uh, today I am doing a two-year update video for you guys. That is, that's right, this is the time of updates. And um, today I'm gonna be doing an update on the Trangia alcohol bottle. Uh, the alcohol fuel bottle or whatever the case, you know, whatever you happen to want to call it. Um, this is the one liter variant. Now, I know a lot of people have, you know, slammed me for using the one liter variant on the original video. But you know what? I like having the alcohol with me and um, you know, I like knowing that my alcohol is going to be safe in a bottle like this rather than one of those little plastic ones. Um, so I, I only really carry this around, I'm going to be honest with you, I only really carry this around when I know I'm going to be in a location where I cannot use any kind of wood or other methods when I know I'm going to have to use my alcohol stove. Otherwise, if I don't know that I'm only going to be using my alcohol stove, I'll only bring a little bottle of alcohol with me because um, it's just a backup, it's an emergency item. But in this particular case, when I know that I'm going someplace where I cannot use a wood-burning stove, I bring this with me. And um, I love it. It is awesome. Nothing on it has, I've had no problems. Durability-wise, this thing is insane. I have dropped this thing. I have tossed it in a backpack. I have done pretty much everything you can to abuse a piece of camping equipment to this thing and it has held up perfectly fine. I haven't had any problems with it at all. Um, <clears throat> the, uh, the, it does have an aluminum ring up here to help you know keep the threading and stuff nice and tight because it does have a plastic threading in there. Um, the aluminum ring is still holding up just fine. I haven't had any problems with that. The threading on this, let me go ahead and release the pressure here. Okay. The, um, come on, really tight. All right. So let me go ahead and show you guys the actual valve. So you can see, so there's the valve. Um, like I said, this is two years old now. And right there you got the valve and the spring system and everything else in there. And it still works just fine. Uh, does not leak. No, no problems with that whatsoever. Everything still comes out just fine. Uh, the screw, as you saw, the screw still works just fine. And what I like to do, and it's one of the things with this top that a lot of people kind of ignore, but that I found actually really useful, is this piece right here. And what I do is I'll put this in one of the mesh pockets on the side of my bag, and I'll piece, put a piece of paracord through here and tie it onto the bag. So that way, if anything happens, this will not come out of my bag, and I make you know I'll know I always have it. Um, I just I really like that little feature. It's just a little extra thing they threw on that people don't think about, but is actually really useful. But um, like I said, I've had this for two years, and it so far it's held up well. It's it's made out of pretty much the same stuff they make gasoline cans out of. Um, so it it just it lasts. It it's nice and thick and durable, but um. As far as things that I would put in here, I would not put actual gasoline in here. Um, I know some people have, but I would I would limit that simply because, um, you know, I don't know what the durability level is that way as far as withholding pressure. And gasoline fumes build a lot of pressure. So I'm not entirely sure if this would fail if you had gasoline, say, for example, on, on a bike, if you strap this to a side of a bike for extra fuel, and um, in the sun and driving around and everything, if it would cause the pressure in here to, you know, cause it to burst. So I would avoid anything like that. But when it comes to alcohol, you know, any kind of alcohol fuel you want to put in here, you're going to be able to stick in here without a problem. But again, um, I'm going to give this a five out of five star. It has not changed my mind in two years. I absolutely, I still love it. It's still my primary fuel bottle. If I'm going to be taking an alcohol stove out, and I know I'm going to be using an alcohol stove, um, so I will have affiliate links to this in the description. So make sure you take a look. And um, like I said, I do support seven countries, so go ahead and take a look. See if your country's there. See if it's one that we support. And um, if it is, you'll be able to buy this straight from your local Amazon. But there you have it, five out of five. But thank you guys for watching. And as always, if you like this video, hit the like button and subscribe. Bye-bye.